this is my 95 240SX and typically the window is not going up. At first I thought it was the window motor, but once uh, talking to a couple 240 guys, they told me that just go ahead, take out the door card, jump the actual window motor, and last time it, it went up and down, you know, unstuck it. Uh, it was working, you know, it was working fine. Right now it's not working. So what we're gonna do, so thanks to my local part out guy in Long Beach, Andrew, shout out. He did uh, post a part out today. So I was able to go snag this. Uh, this is the window amp regulator, which uh, I got today from a part out, uh, brand new. It cost 200 from Nissan. I did not want to pay that. So I was able to grab it for 50 bucks. This might solve the issue I have with the window not working. So I know the window motor is good. So it has to be something to do with the amp regulator so we're gonna go ahead and take out the door so in order to take out the door card you do need to take out this Phillips right here one right here and there's a few down there that we have to take off so we're gonna go ahead and start undoing it once you unbolt it from there you flip it over and you have to disconnect that harness that's right there so here you go, we got it disconnected, just to make sure I put it somewhere safe. Uh, you can leave that right there. Now we're gonna go ahead and take out that Phillips. Uh, so you wanna be gentle when pulling out this trim because it is a 95, so it could be brittle. So just go ahead, take some time, be, uh, be careful with it and gentle. And now it came out. So now we're gonna go ahead and start taking the three, a couple Phillips in the bottom of the car. So one's right there, one's right there went right there just make sure uh, be gentle and when you put it back uh, just be gentle with it don't over tighten it because these door cards are old and it will break once you have all the bolts out just kind of jiggle the door card with some patience and there you go so now what you want to do is so there goes my defective one and there goes a new one all it is to snake the harness and there's two couple built a couple 10 mils right there go ahead and take it off so now we're going to go ahead and take out these two 10 mils that way we can get the window regulator out so i did connect the window switches back again and now i connected the battery and now we're going to mess around with it just because as you can see it's not working but here we push it in you hear it click Nope, it's not working. So we're gonna go ahead and now install our new one. So we went ahead, installed the new one, made sure it's nice and good. We have the car and accessory now. There you go, guys, mission success. So all it was is an amp, and thanks to the contact, Andrew, for $50, we're able to get a new one working. So now we're gonna go ahead, disconnect the window switches, pull back the door card, and try it out again. We went ahead, put this Phillips right here, the ones down there. And also, we added this one that's missing. So we went ahead and uh, connected and secured the negative. Now we're gonna put it in accessory mode. And now, She's working the way it should. So a big shout out to the homie Andrew for hooking it up. And there you go guys. Um, how to replace your window app thingy switch on the 240SX. Yeah. Mm -hmm.